Hey friends, how you doing? Guess what? This stream is earlier than normal. That's right. It's a little earlier than normal. Originally I was like, oh my god, I'm so early. But then I realized it's only really like an hour early. But it's still early. So I'm sorry about that. And I'm also sorry I missed last night's stream, you guys. The hello. Hi. This is how I say hello. I apologize. <laughs> Um, I missed Phoenix Wright last night because I was, uh, I had a family thing come up that I had to take care of unexpectedly. Everybody's okay. Everything's fine. It was just, um, I had not planned on it and I kind of had to do it. So, um, that's where I was. I'm alive and well. Sorry about that. Uh, but I posted about it in the Discord the second I knew it was happening. So, but today, today's also going to be kind of a, um, a quick stream, quicker than I, uh, had planned on as well. Uh, just cause I have to be somewhere later tonight because today was technically my friday i have a three-day weekend baby going to a music festival life's great yay hi vodka fun and thank you yes i yes thank you for caring that everything was good everything was good life's great <laughs> so if you recall uh last stream i royally messed up uh, we went and fought masamune and we lost big time and i think part of my problem is that i have luca so i'm gonna swap luca out and we're gonna go back with Robo. Because um, we were getting pretty wrecked in the defense department. Let's see. I think also our equipment was a problem. Oh man, I didn't realize he loses. He was not in our party when I used the shelter, so he has not been healed. Oh well, we'll see. We'll see how this goes. Let's see how his equipment is. I don't know how long it's been since I saved. But yeah, we got all the way to Mazamune and then we. We choked. We, we died a horrible death. Uh, what's he at? Stamina plus two. Speed plus one. Reveals the HP of enemies. Accuracy plus two. Okay, cool. I think we're going to stick with him as is. Uh, I think we're all the way at the beginning of this. So, yep, we are. Alright, we're, we're going to climb the mountain again, you guys. We're going mountain climbing. At least this time I know not to fall down the water. Oh, wait, actually, I did have to fight the waterfall, or fall down the waterfall, because there was an item. Obtained a shelter. So it's been, I feel like it's been forever since I played this, even though... Did I miss last week's Chrono Trigger? No, I didn't. I just played it on Tuesday. That's why it feels like it's been forever. It's been a long time without you, my friend. Oh, God. Let's use supersonic spin on these boys. Right, Vodka? It, does, it feels like it's been a way long time, but it hasn't even been that long. <laughs> but yeah, I guess just missing that one day or moving that one day made it feel real weird. Yeah, I apologize. I'm I'm normally not this inconsistent with my schedule. It's just September in general as a whole has been a hot mess for me. It's been a... Big old travel. Oh, now. Oh, you know what? I'm the stupidest person in the world. I remember now. I remember why we had, why we had uh, Luca with us. Because those guys, the guys with the hammers, you got to use fire on them. I should go back and get her. Oh man. I guess I could swap her. Why am I not attacking? With? <laughs> I guess I could swap her for Marl, but Marl has the aura, man. She has the aura. What up, Jack? How you doing? Let's see how much these guys take without... Oh my god. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to switch. Man. God dang. God dang. You got a new car? That's awesome. I desperately need a new car. Chrono's gonna die. That's very true. Thank you, Vodka. Thank you for not reporting me to the Better Business Bureau. Oh my god. Chrono's about to die. Can I run? Can't escape. Ugh. I kind of just want to reset. I want to let them die and reset. We're off to a great start, you guys. <laughs> Tonight's stream, where I undo the grave mistakes of last stream, is, uh... Is, is not looking great. But I don't want to waste all my items uh, right off the bat, so let's... We're just gonna... We're just gonna let her die. Can she run? She can't run. Can she attack herself? Because <laughs> we need that. Yeah, we need... We I forgot we do need Luca for a reason. 
just let him die as a military tactic. Hey, look, everyone lived. Okay, let's go back up. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Well, now everyone really has to die. Or I guess, how do I get back to the menu? Like, the home screen menu. I don't know. We're just gonna have to let everybody die, you guys. <laughs> There's. I wish I could walk across this rainbow. <gasps> I wasn't even that far! Oh my god. I didn't have to fight this bird. I thought that I was all the way back in the beginning! <laughs> I'm just the- I'm fucking out of it, you guys. Hi, Chocula! Attack herself. She can exfoliate. Can I use- I can't use a shelter from here, right? Yeah, save point. Okay, um, I don't know what the reset buttons are on the Xbox controller. Yes, it crossed. I've been drinking again. It's five o'clock here. All right. Yeah, I'm just a big old drunk. Left shoulder, right shoulder, start select. That's true, vodka. I'm just confused. I'm gonna zip through all this because A, we already watched it, and B, I need to die. <laughs> I need to die. I, everybody's health is, everybody's dying. Wait, why did I do this? I should have just healed everybody. <laughs> now that I know I don't need, Luca, I don't need to go back. <laughs> oh, why am I the way that I am? Oh no, okay, everybody died. Now we need to let everybody die because I'm an idiot. <laughs> Hello, I'm a professional streamer. <laughs> Could I interest you in partnering me, Twitch? Yeah, Marl solo run. You know there's probably madmen that do that kind of stuff. Oh, man. Okay. Thank you. Okay. The reset button is death. <laughs> Resume bookmark game. Yes. No! Why is that an option? I... Apparently, I bookmarked this somehow? All right, all right, everybody. <laughs> yeah, a very pro gamer. All right, everybody's just getting potioned. Waste all our money. Uh, you need neither? Yeah, you need neither. Boom, boom. All right, perfect, 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 perfect. You have a statistic question for everyone, Jack. Yes, what's your statistic question? Hey, don't go up there. Yes, we want the Masamune. I have to be worthy. How many people is everyone, are everyone sub to? Um, there's a way to see that, right? This, subscriptions. I am subscribed to eight people. It, it counts you, so technically nine. Like if you're, if you, if you're if you have a channel that could be subbed to, it's, it considers that you're subbed, but obviously I don't count that. So I'm subscribed to eight people. All level one. And one is my prime sub. You're subscribed to four people and you have 13 gifted subs. Oh, I didn't actually even look at how many of those are gifted. I think I have one gift sub actually, so maybe I'm seven in one gift sub. Oop, I should pay attention to the game that I'm playing. <laughs> Typically two and two gifted subs. So here's um, the the inside scoop on my sub situation is I used to only sub to like a couple people. Oh no, Chrono. Um, but then what I did was I dropped a lot of my Patreon subscriptions. I was on a lot of Patreons for YouTube channels that I liked and then um, Honestly, a lot of them just kind of stopped either putting out as much content as they had before, or I didn't, I don't, like, I was subscribed to Nikki Jake, I was subscribed to Nikki Jakey on Patreon, and I, I just haven't really been loving his content, so I dropped it, and I was subscribed to Down the Rabbit Hole, so, and that guy, 
I feel bad because I know it's, that he's often stressed by the fact that he takes a long time to put out his content, but this time around felt like it was a really long time for his new content to come out. Like, way, way long. So I didn't, um, so I dropped him. I dropped a few, a couple of Disney vloggers that I was sub to because I'm a little Disneyed out. So, um, yeah, I just, uh, I just fell off a bunch. What up, Gorbish? Yeah, Chrono Pooper, you tell him. You tell him, Chrono Pooper. I don't, so I think, I think Patreon is a desperate cash grab for some people, but I was a part of something for a while that, um, that had a successful Patreon, and, um, it was, it, I don't, it was genuinely helpful. Like, our, the mixer died once and we were able to replace it, we were able to take trips and make content out of it and stuff, so that, that kind of stuff is cool. Yeah, I can't believe you got gifted 13 subs, Vodka. That is insane. That's absolutely insane. Alright, you need to heal yourself, girl. This is bullying. You fell off Patreon altogether? <laughs> oh my god, my throat. Let me tell you, allergies here have been insane this week. Um, and then I found out that it's apparently the third week of September is called... Um, is technically called peak week. I guess it's a huge time for people to get like uh, asthma attacks and uh, allergic reactions. It's like the, the peak of it because of something called ragweed. Ragweed. You only get the 74 page rads. Oh, you're such a, you're so prude with your money. You're a pro lurker. That's pretty much, yeah. I I lurk a lot. Like, sometimes I'll pop in and I'll say something in a stream that I haven't talked in in a while. And they'll be like, oh, I haven't seen you in a while. I'm like, you haven't seen me, but I've seen you. <laughs> and, then I, uh, and then I raise my eyebrows up and down like a creep. <laughs> and then I wink at them. But they can't see any of it. But I can see them. I'm not ready for fall. I'm not. I love that Rossetti. Uh, that that Rossetti emote. Fell off Patreon because when you were watching Channel Awesome, everyone did it at once. Oh, and you knew they were gonna uphold certain things. See, I I don't like that. That's part of that's another part of the reason that I fell off a couple of other um, Patreons that I was on. And again, if you're just joining, I'm skipping through all this uh, this text because we already watched this. I did this last stream and I died. <laughs> you forget if you're down the rabbit hole, patron slash thoughty. Uh, yeah, it's, I'm in a weird conundrum with Down the Rabbit Hole's Patreon, because, like, it is, he does put out good content, and I have no doubt that he genuinely, like, puts his all into the content, but after waiting so long, and then getting the Temple OS, like, I didn't feel like the Temple OS one was, like, as good as I was expecting. And then on top of that, um, this most recent one took forever. But then I saw it turned out to be two hours. So that's like making a movie, you know? That's like making a real documentary, so. You spent the whole day watching the Wings episode yesterday? See, I have I need to watch the Wings episode, and I haven't had any time all week. Um, well, I guess since yesterday of the day, not all week. Um, and I want to watch it tonight, hopefully, after I have to go, I have to go do something, but then I have, that, hopefully I can watch it after. And then, uh, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how time works out. My god. Oh, I accidentally healed the wrong person. <laughs> Whoa. Robo's gonna die, bro. I'm excited to watch that Wings of Redemption thing. I don't know who he is. Uh, Dusty, actually. Hi, Dusty. Dusty was telling me a little bit about it. Oh, Robo. Robo! We gotta heal. We gotta heal, bro. I know, the damage. That's part of the problem, Vodka, is I'm taking so much damage. Because I my, my armor is... My armor is not good. Uh, but... I'm already all the way up the hill, so if I die again, um, then we can go down the hill and we can go get some 
new equipment. But I figured, well, I did. I, let's not be. Let's not be. Uh, let's let's not kid ourselves. I didn't decide to do this fight right off the bat. I forgot where I was, and we ended up doing this fight right off the bat. So, Aura Beam. Small amount to all allies. What's the difference between Aura Beam and Allah? Allah and uh, Aura. What you call it? Oh, it's with it's with Robo instead of with Chrono. It's a hard watch just by virtue of the Wings fellow being a total pariah. I mean, that's kind of how some of his stuff is in general. The My favorite is definitely Final Fantasy House. I love Final Fantasy House. That is the most fascinating shit to me. Why are people the way that they are? Why are you the way that you are? I'm just constantly healing. I don't even have time. I don't even have time to do any attacks. You have a bone to pick with me, Rolo. Hi, Rolo. What's the bone? What's the bone you gotta pick? I, <laughs> I didn't forget to grind the jack. I forgot to go get more equipment. <laughs> so we started off, and I thought that I was at the bottom of the hill, but it turns out I'm at the top of the hill, uh, right before the boss. And so we're back. We're back at the boss. And yeah, I. Uh, I'm kind of catching up on stuff. I'm sorry, I've, I've been missing a few, a little couple of chats. Uh, but yes, the ooh, oh my god. Um, some Patreons are very ridiculous about what they ask, what they, what their rewards are versus like what you're paying. At least in my opinion. Okay, everybody just attack me now. Oh, you're just saying hi, Rolo. That's how, you, that's how we say hi now. <laughs> Yeah, exactly, vodka. I'm doing a, I'm doing a no, a no gear run, a no good gear run. Oh god. How much damage would you say that this guy av uh, does on average to people? Oof. Athenian water. On mother horse eyes because of rabbit hole. I don't remember that one. I'm sure I, I th I'm pretty sure I've watched everything that he's put out. I mean, there's like one of those channels where oh everybody's gonna die. Uh, one of those channels where I found it and I was like this is the best shit and I watched it a million. I watched it for like a million hours. Okay. Yes, Chocula, you should check out uh, down the rabbit hole. It's great. Okay. Yeah, we gotta go back and get better equipment. Oof. Oof. Yeah, Patreons with a $1 tier with benefits. Always great. Okay. Easy allies? I don't know who that is. Where would you recommend to go get equipment? Probably like... I guess there's that nearby town, right? A tad under 100. Could have been higher. Well, I mean, we'll grind on the way down. So, and back up. So, hey. Pay 50 bucks to get a piece of trash from my room. I should start doing that. Hey guys, you want me to vacuum and then send you a bunch of Juno's fur for the low, low price of $100? Subscribe to my Patreon. And it's coming right to you. You have a recommendation. What's your recommendation? Is it for the Patreon? Is it for the new Patreon that we're about to... Or is it going to be get good? Is it going to be get good? Yeah, yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let the record show uh, that I said it before it came up in my chat. Let the record show! Some guy who told a story through posts scattered across Reddit. It's not the guy, the programmer guy who ended up being the, uh, being like a huge pedophile, right? That's one of my most fascinating, I missed a thing. The most fascinating Reddit stories to me. Oh yeah, we can't interrupt his, am his ambush. Um, whoop. Can we go this way? Uh, there was some guy who would give out programming advice all the time on Reddit, on one of the like specific programming subreddits, and then it, uh, it turned out that he was like a convicted of a bunch of child porn and stuff. And people were appalled. Oh no, I don't know where I am. I'm lost. I'm lost. Ugh. 
you rip out of your. I read that sh that at first, Chocula, that you said uh, that you ripped out of your Hulk, your uh, Ultimania shirt, as in like Final Fantasy Ultimania. <laughs> a weird ass story about the Cold War, except there's alien portals that look like vaginas. That sounds like a. Uh, I don't know if you watch Orange Is the New Black, but that sounds like something that uh, Crazy Eyes would write. Also, Gorbish. Guess what? Guess what? Uh, I'm gonna see Carly Rae Jepsen. On s can I not fight this guy? On Sunday. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. <laughs> yeah, not jealous. No jealousy. Not at all. Not detecting any of it. Nope. None here. You only know her for that one song. Are you talking about Call Me Maybe? Call Me Maybe is easily one of her, uh, like, most cliche songs. Uh, so, yes. Yes, she is good. You should check out um, the her two newest albums, Dedicated and Emotion. Um, Dedicated is the newest one, Emotion. Oops, shit. I just used the wrong thing. Emotion is a couple of years old at this point, but it's very good. If you like pop music... It's like, it's all, it's all very solid, good, like, pop, it's good pop music. I, I love Kylie Rae Jepsen, though, so I'm, I'm biased, I'm not gonna lie to you. You're going to TwitchCon? I contemplated TwitchCon, but then I ended up going to PAX instead. Alright, Vodka. Have fun lurking, and thank you for stopping in. Sorry again that the, that the stream was a little earlier than, than usual. But thank you, I appreciate you popping in anyway. Despite the unexpected schedule change. You're into video game music and metal? Ah, uh, I went to Distant Worlds. You should uh, you should go to a Distant Worlds concert if you ever have the chance. Well, I guess it's not really a concert, it's a symphony. I don't know. Would a fancy person correct me by uh, calling a, uh, a symphony a concert? <laughs> Is it still a concert? I don't know. Check out Bad Guy by Car Carly Rae Jepsen. First of all, that's spelling upsetting. Second of all, I am also going to see Billie Eilish tomorrow night. <laughs> I'll have you know. This music is so good. I love this battle music. It's the funky bass. Billie Eilish. Rolo, that is not at all a thing that happened. I did not say I was going to TwitchCon. You didn't buy a twi ticket to TwitchCon. Don't be feeding me no lies. Oh, that's what the 19 badge is for. You're right, yeah. I forgot they give you custom badges when you buy a TwitchCon ticket. So actually, uh, Jack, uh, Distant World skips uh, Las Vegas all the time as well. I was only able to go by traveling elsewhere. Hey, we made it back down the mountain. Let's save. I really want to know how to get frog. But I assume it wants us to get the sword first. Okay, what's down here? Fiona's Villa. Oh yeah, this is a lady whose husband is missing. I forgot that there's not, like, overworld battles in here, and I get paranoid walking around. Can we sleep here? Is there an inn? The market. Residence. And, nope. Okay, let's just go to the market, then. Squid Billy Elvis. You'd never go to TwitchCon the second someone verbally said a Twitch email aloud. You'd crow you'd cringe, your soul your soul would leave your body, I'm sure. Um okay. I think we're doing okay on like items. Items? Where can I buy equipment? I remember what's this? Oh, it's locked. I remember there's a guy. The guy that we ran into at the county fair. Well, I guess it's not a county fair. Oh, there's a whole thing down here. Did we even go here? 
I don't think we did. Let's take let's take a nap. Um, I do. I'm interested in going to TwitchCon. If I if I had a bunch of people that I knew that would were also going, I would go because I feel like that's the type of convention where it really comes down to hanging out with your friends. Um, but I don't have any of those. <laughs> no, I do have some, but um, nobody who wanted to go to TwitchCon this year. Although, I don't know if you guys know Action Bastard who's in here sometimes. I know he's going. I'm going to ta I'm going to be Tata's bride one day. We I, we didn't even go down here at all. If only I had some spiced jerky. What a wonderful wondrous meal I could make. The boxes beside the bed have been handed down through this family for generations. I'm not the slightest inkling what's within. Find a way to open them and the contents are yours. A place known as the Magic Cave lies east from the from the Denadoro Mountains. That place will send chills down a grown man's spine. Tata bears the hero's badge. At first I thought it was I thought it for a fake, but it's a genuine article. He truly is the hero of legend. I suspect he's combing the Denadoro Mountains to the north even now, searching for the sword the legends speak of. That must be the guy who ran away when we were approaching the mountains. What up, Melfina? Nobody will go with you to Japan, you have to go alone. I mean, I'm going to Japan alone. I'm sure you can find someone to go to Japan. My own son, the legendary hero. Seems I sired myself a champion. Can't say I truly see it, but I don't suppose I ought to question good fortune. Father of the hero. Heh <laughs> I like the ring of it. Alright. Yeah, exactly. Cons are not fun alone. My grandson is the great hero. That's from my side of the family. Hee hee hee. You know, classic grandpa. Hee hee hee. TwitchCon and VidCon are for people who are really into themselves, but that's just you. You don't like crowds. That's, yeah, that's why I think, like, if you were going to go with a bunch of friends, that would be fun. Or even if, like, if you had enough of a following where, like, your followers wanted you to go, that'd probably be cool. A strange monster came here drinking not long past, mumbling about a queen lean and this Masamu this and Masamune that. Oh, I read that sentence way wrong. She <laughs> sure was an ugly frog, man. <laughs> I cannot believe Legendary Hero is a boy from this very village. Have you heard the latest? No, what's the latest? Well then, let me be the one to tell you. The Legendary Hero is from our own village. You fuck. <laughs> this game. Ah! <laughs> you found the 25th anniversary Skyward Sword on eBay for only 50 bucks. Dang. I have... Wait a second, Corbish. Hold on. Hold on. Are you from the States? Or are you in Canada? Uno momento.
All right. Oh, damn. All the searching. You're from Canada. As I say, I can just send it to you. If you really want it. This has just been sitting on my shelf for a decade, unplayed. I have the music digitally uploaded to my computer. All right. Well, that was worth... That was... <laughs> That was like, I thought I knew exactly where it was, uh, and then I didn't know exactly where it was, so that took me a lot longer than I intended. <laughs> My bad, guys. Okay, we're back. We're back in business. Oh, we meet again. Oh, hey, this is the guy that ran over. Oh, no, this is the other guy. I also love having physical copies of stuff. I'm about it. I collect vinyl. I have my video game shelf back there. I have all sorts of shit. Cheers to your safety and success. I tracked down the rainbow shell that that Dorino elder held, hired me to find. It's on a small island, it seems. But there's the rub. I don't know which one. The money you fronted me is all gone, too. Oh, what should I do? I can't believe that Naughty, your little urchin, Tata, is the legendary hero. I love that the legendary hero's name is Tata. Have you heard about the magic cave? The one east of the Denadero Mountains? I saw a sheer rock wall there, like a part of a castle gate. Then a host of fiends strolled right in. Let's leave Magus and his cronies to their own devices, unless you want trouble. All right. Oh yeah, we already talked to her. Okay, where can I go buy equipment? I've not seen little Tata lately. I wonder where he's gone off to. I suppose I can count my blessings. Things are a lot quieter without that little brat causing trouble. Everybody hates Tata. You have some VHS? Uh, Chocula, I have... My parents were going to get rid of all the old Disney VHS we had from when I was a kid, and I was like, please, I'd, I'll keep that. And So I have that, but it's still at their house, so I've got to go get it. Oh, you got to get a record player. you got to get a record player, my friend. It's so worth it. Okay. Where, oh, where could I buy equipment? I guess let's go. There's a magic cave. Um, I don't know if I should go to magic cave first. Maybe we could grind at the magic cave. Yeah, that's true. A very good, a very good setup is expensive. But I mean, I have a decent like. I don't have anything very fancy, but I have decent speakers. I have decent bookshelf speakers. Where did I get? There's somewhere else that has equipment because I got the. Do I have to time travel? You don't have one because you have children. That's fair. Because this guy only has items. Hmm. You're back at Dinosaur's Tale? I love that movie. When I was a kid. I haven't watched it in a long time. Put it in your bathroom. That's terrible advice. I mean... A titanium vest. You have Caban's vest. Iron helm. I don't know. I don't know what else... I guess maybe let's go check out this cave. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll get wrecked. Or maybe we'll find... So maybe we'll find some nice equipment. Oh no, we can't go up there. Never mind. There's gotta be a hidden way in. Maybe we have to have frog. Hmm. I guess maybe we'll just have to grind. Unless. How I forget how to get back to the party. No, how do we get back to the that place? The place in the in the void. <laughs> how do we get there? The time travel. Hmm. It 
it just feels really early to have to grind, especially because I didn't, I don't recall running away from any battles. I guess we haven't checked out this, well, no, I did check out this forest, that's where Frog is. Thought we did. Yeah, we did. Let's see what happens. We're gonna skip these guys. We're dodging. He's still blocking that chest. <laughs> I want this chest. Uh, I know you're not feeling like a hero, bro. I know life's got you down, but I really want that chest. <laughs> Streamlabs is giving away a fully paid trip to TwitchCon. Oh, dang. I forget, there's a way to... I think you kill the snake and then the snake eats the frogs, or it's vice versa. Oh my god, Gorbush. I am the absolute worst when it comes to that. As far as, like, I'm like, I'm gonna stop by and dumb shit. And then, guess what I... <laughs> Guess what I just did? Bought some dumb shit. It's it without fail. I was actually I was supposed to be saving up to buy a car. And then I was like, I'm going back to Tokyo <laughs> instead. I'm going, going back back to Tokyo. Let's fight these guys. We'll just fight everybody again. You got your car anyway? Hell yeah. I definitely need a new car. <laughs> well, but that's why you can't get a Switch. I, I mean, I feel like a car is more important than a Switch. I drive a very old car, and I live in a very hot place. And for the past couple of summers, my AC... I could feel that it was starting to give a little bit, um, but this summer it was giving a lot more often and at way more oppor inopportune times, uh, and it was pretty bad. <laughs> so I think uh, by next summer I definitely have to get a new car. I don't think it's going to last another summer. Poor little baby car. So basically I go to Portland next weekend. And then after that, I have to, like, I have to cool it. I have to cool it until Tokyo. Uh, but I, there's no way I really need to reel it in. Okay, let's save. Let's climb the mountain again. It's the first car you've had AC in in 10 years, and you used to live in Southern California. Jesus. Yeah, that's not fun, man. When I got back to town from a trip recently... I drove to my parents' house, and they live, like, an hour outside of town, and my AC gave out on the way there, and it did not come back by the way back, <laughs> and I, like, I think one of the nights that I canceled my stream was because that happened. I got home, and I was just, like, absolutely fucking dead, and sweaty and gross, had to take a shower, like, ugh. What do I do that has me across the country so much? I, I'm i in IT, and that's normally what I'm traveling for, but this month in particular. So at the end of, actually at the end of August, I did travel for work. But then this month in particular, I've been actually taking personal trips. Uh, so, oh shit, wrong thing. Um, and then Tokyo is also a personal trip. So there's a pretty good chance that in October, November, I'm probably going to have to travel for work, but I don't know for a fact yet. You can just refill the AC. No, it's not. I can't. Re it, I know what you're talking about. The little. I have one of those cans in my closet right now, actually. Um, it's past that point. It's, it's something, something more serious is messed up with it, but I just haven't taken it in because I don't even want to pay the diagnostic on a 95, you know? Uh, that I've already had so much I've already had so much done to it. It's a good car. I love the car. It's chugging along. I could probably still get it fixed and get another 10 years out of it, but it's just at this point like I don't know. 
I've never had a car from this millennium, and I would kind of like to have a car from this millennium. Uh, one time when my old car got totaled uh, because someone rear-ended me and just barely bent the frame uh, enough to total it, I uh, I had a rental car that was like a, the current year's car, and I was like, oh, what a world. <laughs> what world this is? Electric windows? Electric windows? <laughs> Uh, yes, Melf, I am going to Portland, Oregon. It's gonna be a very quick trip. I'm going for a concert with a coworker. I don't know if you guys know Shura. We're gonna go see Shura. Yeah, dude, across when the AC was working, it's great. And like I said, I probably could get it fixed and it would still be great. But I just, um, I've already, like, got new tires got a new alternator you know like there comes that point of like where you want to what do they call it like the there's like that sunken time fallacy there's also that i feel like that also happens with money where you got to be careful that you're not like holding on to something just because you've sunk money into it and i don't want to keep sinking money into it but then again having no car payment lets me do dumb things like go to tokyo <laughs> so And I just renewed my registration, you guys. And you guess guess how much my registration was? Just guess. I'll tell you. It was sixty dollars. <laughs> it cost me half of the amount of my actual registration to get the smog check, basically. Well, a third, twenty dollars or whatever. Tink, tink, tink. I guess I probably could have bought more uh, potions and stuff. 200 in California for registration plus smog. I don't know what it is. It goes by... It goes by whatever car you have, I think, here. Or, like, whatever year it is, maybe. Oh, I keep getting these, like, dry, horrible moments in my throat. It's terrible. know, Jack, that there are places where you don't have to get a smog check? Like, there are states where that's not a thing? It blew my mind. Oh, you live in one now? Dang. Yeah, the first time someone, I think it was a friend that I had, I think it was in, they live in Texas. Uh, the first time someone told me that, I was like, what do you mean? What do you mean you don't, don't know what a smog check is? Oregon doesn't have them? That's surprising to me because I would think that... Well, I guess Oregon's kind of like Nevada in that way where it's like... You think Oregon and you think Portland and you think the whole state would be like that. Um, which is similarly, people hear Nevada and they think Las Vegas and they think the whole state is like that. But the rest of it is like the complete opposite. Cause yeah, I mean, at a at a gut reaction, I would think that they'd be about that life. You're on the Washington state side. Oh yeah, that's right. That's surprising to me too, though, that Washington wouldn't have it. Don't be confusing my people, little bird. Get that bird. Get that bird. Mountains are so nice. That guy's suspicious. What's that guy's deal? <laughs> Alright, let's use a shelter. Uh, let's double check on equipment. Does any can anybody get anything better? Where did I get a golden helmet? your best, the best thing for you. It is. I, okay. I really don't know where I'm supposed to be getting equipment from. There has to be somewhere that I could get better equipment from, but I'm gonna try this one more time. Oh, I forgot to use a, uh, shelter. In 
Portland and Eugene, there is smog check. Okay, so that makes sense. Those are two places that I would expect would have it. Can I go over here? Oh. I can't believe I missed that. Wait, what was that? A speed capsule. I saw that little flashing light for a split second. Look at you go. Probably shouldn't have used that on Chrono. He's already pretty fast. Don't wake them. Oh no. I should have woken them because now I have to fight everybody at once. Uh oh. Even if you played- Oh, you know what? Gorbish? I think that's why I've never played Skyward Sword is because I didn't have Motion Plus. So I just have the game. And I, uh... And I've never played it. Because I remember I bought it and then being like, Oh, whoops. <laughs> so now you're in the same boat as me. You did buy- You bought a $50 CD. That CD is really great, though. In Illinois, there's a minimum sw smog quota you have to meet. If your car is not polluting this much, you cannot drive it. I was really impressed by when I was just in Chicago over the weekend. I was really impressed by the the way that the lake was. Like the lake is freaking clean looking and nice, at least the, where I was. Sup, Ultros? All right, we're gonna skip through this again. Or since you said swap, I guess I should say old twos. Swap old twos. <laughs> tink, 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 tink. These evil little demon boys. This part is not that bad. I don't feel like I've leveled at all. I don't feel like my grinding will have helped. It wasn't really grinding. <laughs> it was more like I walked around a little bit. Just do an octopus things. Perfect, perfect. On brand. Every review you see of Chicago was like that. Way cleaner than I thought. Food was good. I mean, honestly, it was way cleaner than I thought. But I, I was in like the swanky area, I think. So I don't know that that counts. I would really like to use Aura Whirl. Oh. Okay. Bad time. I did eat portillos. Is it pronounced portillos or portillos? <laughs> I had it though. I just realized I've never said it out loud. I've only talked about it uh, in text. Portillos, okay. It was really good. I was told that I must eat it. I told it was mandatory. God damn it. Just manually. Just do this one at a time. Oh yeah, definitely all cities have their rough spots. I actually didn't realize that Portillo's was a chain. Everybody talks about it so much that I thought it was like... Uh, I didn't realize it was a chain. I just thought it was like a restaurant that you had to go to. What does Napalm do? Let's find out. Potions, sir. Oh god, Luca. Uh, Portillo's Jack is a as a restaurant in Chicago. Uh, I think they're big, like they're most what they're most known for is the hot dogs. The hot dogs are good, uh, but they have all sorts of good, like they have like pasta and all sorts of things. I had a hot dog and I had a. Polish dog. It's funny because, like, yeah, Vegas, I don't think has any, like, I don't feel like we have any sort of ch 
chain that's specific to us that you like gotta eat. I guess Capriati's is pretty good. It's a sandwich place, but I don't think that's Vegas specific. I think it's, I think it's from somewhere else. And like we have In and Out, but again, not Vegas specific. We have lots of good restaurants on the strip. Okay, we leveled up there, but I mean, now we're about to be thrown right into the other fight. You don't have Jack in the Box? I know you don't have In and Out. Um, to me, I, I know a lot of people swear by Jack in the Box, but I don't think Jack in the Box is very good. <laughs> uh, Jack in the Box is good for when you're in high school and you're really drunk or you're really high and you want 99 cent tacos. And that should be the only thing you should be going to touch Jack in the Box for. <laughs> Toronto's bad spots are sort of sparse and isolated. Oh, um, I've seen a lot of, I, I follow the subreddit uh, public freakout on uh, on Reddit and there's a lot of, there's usually a lot of like uh, Toronto tr public transportation posts there. <laughs> You went to Vegas. Your family was so hyped, but turns out they just brought you along to babysit the kids. No, that is that does feel bad, man. I feel bad on your behalf. You, what you should have done is you should have found that there's a um, there's this thing in the locals casinos called um, Kid Zone. And when I was a kid, I wanted nothing more than to go to the fucking Kid Zone. It looks so cool because it's like a giant McDonald's play place, like a giant one. And, uh, now that I'm older, I realize that I don't want to go there because it's for people whose kids, who, like, want to abandon their kids for the day <laughs> while they go gamble. <laughs> and it's, like, when you're, it's since they're in the locals' casinos, it's usually, like, people with, like, severe gambling problems <laughs> who are leaving their kids there. <laughs> you have Hardee's, but no Carl's. Hardee's is Carl's Jr. Cross. You're, you're, you're not missing anything. They're literally the same exact restaurant. They're just called different things on the on different coasts. Yeah! I like that this guy says, yeah. Oh my god. Please! Luca! This is not going any better. I can attest to Cross Cottonwood's saying that he wants to come to Vegas and lose at least $300, because I feel like you've said that amount, that specific amount to me before. I have a bunch of fish restaurants. Fish restaurants? That's actually, that sounds good. I hope the person that I'm going to Portland with likes seafood. When I was in Seattle recently, the people that I was with, neither of them liked seafood. I was like, no! <laughs> Public transit is trash, and they spent money to make it trashier. That's a bummer. Oh my god. I'm doing bad, guys. I'm doing real bad. You have Burger Bill. I don't know what Burger Bill is. Also, Taco Time is a name that I hadn't seen in a long time. I forget who said Taco Time. I saw that. Sorry. It's weird. Like, you kind of weirdly have to pay attention in this game because of the way that the... The way that the timing on the ATB works. Like, the, yeah, the boss, the boss don't give a shit what you're doing. You gotta hurry up. It is a genuine goal. You either make 300 or lose 300. Gain life experience. Hell yeah. I'm not a huge gambler, especially not on the strip, uh, but I've been known to do it in my younger days. In my younger days, I gambled what I would drink. Oh my god, Luca. Luca, you're gonna die. Why is he, like, only attacking Luca? I feel like this is har uh, targeted harassment. Thank you. Taco, taco, taco. Uh, when I uh, when I think about local chains, I think about when I go to Kentucky, and I remember from being a kid that they have 
the fucking, now I can't remember the name of it. <laughs> the place, oh, Captain D's. They have a, a fast food seafood place called Captain D's, and I remember going there when I was a little kid. And I, the reason I remember is because I distinctly remember my dad accidentally picking up vinegar and pouring it all over his rice, his white rice, uh, <laughs> instead of soy sauce, and being like so sad, and that Captain D's was nice enough to give him some new rice. Because he wasn't like mad or anything, he just went up to them and was like, hey, I did a dumb thing. I'm sorry, can I have some more rice? And they were like, yeah, you can have some more rice, bro. <laughs> you go to Seattle often enough? Bellingham? Oh my god, I looked away for two seconds, someone died! What happened here? Sorry guys, I'll catch up on chat here in a moment. Get Chrono first. Oh my god, everybody's gonna die! Why didn't I use Aura Whirl? Everybody, everybody Wang Chung tonight. Hold on, let's pause for a second. Keep talking about local chains. <laughs> It'll give me the strength I need. I've only been to Seattle once, actually, and it was just a couple of weeks ago for PAX. Sounds like you guys have all the, pretty much the, reg the regulars ultras as far as fast food chains. Although I don't know what a Harvey's is. I don't know what Izzy's is. Izzy's the buffet. We have, I mean, obviously Vegas buffet city, bitch. Uh, we have tons of buffets. <laughs> I would, I would never go to like a fast food buffet or like a CC's or a. I don't know why people who live here go to like. Well, I do know why people could go to Sweet Tomatoes because it's not the same style of buffet. But like, I don't know. I'm spoiled by like fancy ass buffets here. Uh, you worry that you <laughs> develop a gambling problem immediately. Yeah, uh, I mean, it can get you. It can get you real good, especially if you win. Uh, once you win, you're like, oh, man, I can just keep going. I'll win more. But that's how they get you. That's how they get you. You win a little bit. You just got to cash out. You you put in 20, you get up to 40, cash out. You're good. That's you doubled your money. <laughs> Don't try to get up to 100. Try Burgerville when I'm near here. Yeah, I don't know. I, I kind of want to try hipstery Portland bed and breakfast foods and shit <laughs> when I'm there. <laughs> I feel like that's the experience. Experience, man. I feel like I'm gonna need to heal after this, yes. Why the fuck is my life the way that it is? You know what, though? It, this confirms for me that we should be able to keep just grinding, because this went better than expected. Oh god, use a mid potion. We'll get Marl in a second, otherwise we're gonna die. Harvey's is Canadian exclusive burger chain. They top it before your eyes, like Subway. Oh, okay. That's cool. Oh my god. Why can't I make up my mind? Everybody just use a mid potion. Fuck it. We need big heal. Oh, I did not mean to just heal herself. God damn it. <laughs> Whoopsie. Everything seems to close like seven or eight, so it seems. Eh. See, that's one thing is like, Vegas is not like a huge city, but that is one thing that I'm spoiled by here is like, if I want to go do anything in the night, I can go do it. Fucking Luka. Oh man, Burger King this is gross. Burger King used to be good, but every Burger King in town here is so bad that it's ruined Burger King itself. Yeah, she, I, I don't know. She's dying like crazy. It, I mean, it's my own fault. I'm under leveled, I feel like, or at least under equipped. I can't decide which is the problem, but definitely it's one of those. If I'm stuck at the airport, that's a good call. You, you, there is like good airport food, you know. You gotta know what the you know you gotta know what the good uh, airport spots are. She's dead again. Chick Fil A, yeah, we uh, we didn't have Chick Fil A until a couple of years ago. Uh, we had never had it because the the owner was like a being like, we'll never go to to Las Vegas because of their moral code. Yeah, yeah. Guess what? Guess where you are now, bro. 
you're in Las Vegas. Everybody just heal. Everybody just heal. <laughs> I think Chick-fil-A is good for us. The spicy chicken, extra pickles, add pepper jack. Mwah. Mwah. All right, Chrono is almost out of mana. Also, in and out I, I've seen people say that they think in and out is overrated, and I don't agree with that. I think in and out is great. I think it deserves its praise. That was a little bit of lag on the game side there. <gasps> you know what I just realized? Did I do it? Did I figure- did I crack the fucking code? It just dawned on me. I don't know if you guys remember this, but there was a person in- in one of the taverns that told us something about, like, that a cyclone will make a whirlwind go away? I don't know. There was something about, like, wind-on-wind wind violence. And I just realized that this whole time this guy's been storing whirlwind energy. Maybe I've been- it's supposed to be that I was- I was supposed to be doing, a. Uh, Cyclone to cancel that, and that's why he's doing all that big damage. Oh my god. Go. Go, 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 go. Oh god. Oh god. Well, now everybody's about to die. Oh! <gasps> I'm not gonna level two people, but hey, I'm gonna take that victory, you guys. There's 38 Portillos? That's crazy. I can't believe I just won this fight. <laughs> they beat us, Masa. Okay, let's check. Let's catch up on chat here real quick. Burger King is like, they fucking dunk their burgers in the water before they give it to you. So, for me, in Vegas, the, all the Burger Kings have the opposite problem, where it's like they, uh, they let it sit under the heat lamp for 25 hours before they give it to you. <laughs> Oy. You never really had a burger from fast food? Had your first Dave's original single last week? I think Wendy's has a pretty good burger. Um, you know, you know. That boss having the hot for Luca. That's exactly what it was like. He was definitely harassing her. She was being, uh, she was being, uh, targeted. Unfairly. And yeah, Chick-fil-A's waffle fries are very good, Oldros. Uh, their chicken sandwiches, I think they're good. And also, uh, Cross, I don't know about you and your cold nuggets. Maybe stop ordering nuggets then. Quick in these nuggies. And yeah, In-N-Out is great because it's the price that it is for what you get, I think, is the... the uh, like, Five Guys? Five Guys is so expensive. And I hate Five Guys fries. They're just, like, sopped in grease. It's disgusting. Uh, and yeah, exactly, Ultros. I don't know why they were so apprehensive to put, uh, put one here in Vegas, Chick-fil-A. But... They learned their lesson. We fucking people in Vegas love Chick Fil A. The lines are always insane. You have no Popeyes, Canes, Chipotle, or Del Taco. Oh my god! I can't believe you don't have Popeyes. Popeyes is so good. Oh, oh. You usually have at least one. And Chipotle is actually pretty weird to not have. Canes is like Canes tr situates itself only in at first like in cities that like were had colleges. Like they were like a university restaurant of some sort. Like it, it was weird their locations. But now they seem to have them all over the place. And Sonic, um, I think Sonic is good, but it's very controversial. <laughs> um, I, they have the best ice in the whole world, man. They have them. They have them everywhere. Thank you for your congrats as well and your GGs. Yeah, I don't know what your deal is with with cold nuggets, my dude. <laughs> and I also remember when Chipotle was like, like people were not about Chipotle, and then it just blew up out of nowhere, man. It's crazy crazy and your brother's dog you tell that brother's dog you say shh dog <laughs> that was fun do you think they'll fix us will they find our proper owner yes it'll be alright alright let's take this sword You were 12 when you last had Chick-fil-A and got cold nuggets. You need to settle down. So this is the Masamune. 
It looks like it's been broken for ages. All right, we got a broken sword. I didn't know this whole time we were fighting for a broken sword. I'd like to take back <laughs> all my efforts, please. Allow me. We'll ride the wind down to the base of the mountain. Thank God, because we only have <laughs> one person alive. Good luck to you. Thank you, boys. Yeah, the big salmonella thing with Chipotle. Um, there was a decent amount in Vegas that got hit, but yeah, my understanding is that there were some places that just got absolutely shit on by them. Let's take a nap. Wait, can I not stay at this inn? Hello? I guess let's go to the other inn where I know we can stay. Popeye's all over Oregon, just not where you are. Okay. Alright, alright. The poor inn. The poor people. Oh wait, yeah. Yeah, that, it, Five Guys is very expensive. It's very spincy. <laughs> yeah, people that go to the gym do tend to love... Uh, Watch my god, love Chipotle. I like when I go there and I'm being, I'm, I'm, I'm all a slob, and there's like some small dude in front of me. No rice. I'm like, mm. <laughs> extra rice, please. Okay, we need to buy some more Athenian waters and some more shelters. Maybe some more mid potions. All right, let's. I think I, my hunch. We have a sword that's broken, and we have a frog that's broken. I feel like we should bring the broken sword to the broken frog. What say you? Let's try it out. Because also, I think that's the only place we have that we can go right now. <laughs> oh, what up, Carl? Can Chipotle link your credit card info twice? Um, there's a place, there's an alternative to, to Chipotle here called Zabas. It's a local chain. And they had this issue where their, apparently their card system wasn't actually processing transactions at the end of the day and I didn't realize because I'm fucking don't I didn't check every day uh, and then when they realized they went ahead and just charged everyone for like a month's worth of shit and I go there all the time so all of a sudden I just had like $200 worth of Zabas charges and they were like sorry I was like I understand but like maybe you should send out some sort of communication first <laughs> before you <laughs> I felt bad for them though they were absolutely like I like I called it such a long hold. Like I and they're a small, they're a local chain, so it's not like they have like a huge infrastructure. Um, and they gave me one free meal, so that's cool. What's the streamer's opinion on Trudeau and blackface? My opinion is that we don't, we're not talking about politics, Dusty. <laughs> Chipotle stock is worth more than any other restaurant train, chain. Huh. Fun fact. Um, I don't know how I feel about that Popeye's chicken sandwich. I didn't eat it, but I doubt anything from Popeye's could be worth waiting in a line that long for. Like, Popeye's is good, but... No thank you. No thank you. Alright. Hey, Frog, I have a cool sword for you. Can I do anything with this sword? Usable by? Hmm. Or maybe, okay, let's take it down to where the hero's supposed to be? Where is this hero? Tata. Tata? Where is Tata? Oh shit, I didn't mean to attack the, fro the froggies. Yeah, I'd rather just in general avoid talking politics in here. I had, for a long time since I since this channel's pretty small, I hadn't put up, like, chat rules or anything. Obviously, I have just, like, the silly chat rules of have fun and, or don't. Uh, but I've been thinking lately I might have to... might have to lay some ground, some ground rules down. Not that anybody's out of control or anything, but just... There's been a few topics that have come up either in the Discord or in the chat where I'm like, oh man. <laughs> you know? You know? 
life is already uh, such a shit show, and I feel like people just people come to people come to Twitch to uh, Twitch to Twitch to just like not think about politics and not argue about that kind of stuff and at least I do I'm not a, I'm not about that I like to shut off and play video games put my head in the sand so to speak you know you know oh you finally got a solid state cross your life's gonna be so good solid state I mean I use m.2 you know like a real pro but hey <laughs> all right see ya Jack thanks for hanging out to put a pin in all the DMC talk. No, we're never putting a, a pin in the DMC talk. Unless you mean DMC, uh, like DMC Devil May Cry, the game specifically, then yes, we'll put a pin in that. Um, let's see if we can find Tata. Tata's house. Are you Tata? Huh, forgive me. Truth be told, I plucked this badge from the floor of the tavern. Some besotted froggish fellow dropped it as he stumbled out. The frog! I thought to sell it, see? But then everyone started calling me the hero when they saw it, and well, I didn't know what to do but to go along with it. Give me it back! Oh, his dad heard him, he's in trouble. But it's too much for me, this hero business. I've had enough. Here, you can have the badge. Oh, what was I thinking? I knew it'd turn out to be something like this. I ought to have seen it sooner. Oh, man. This kid's dad is not mad, he's disappointed, which is the worst thing. Oh, letting myself get all swept up when I should have been looking out for my boy. Well, from now on, I'll make sure both of our feet stay on the ground. For his dear departed mom's sake. Oh, that's actually a really nice reaction. I thought for sure this kid was about to get ripped a new one by his dad. Let's save again. Let's go back to Frog now. We got a hero's badge. Frog. Frog, frog, frog. Oh, yeah, food. We can talk about food. We can talk on food. Yeah, this channel is definitely built on Final Fantasy X and Devil May Cry. Lest you forget, Dusty. Lest you forget the origin of the no respect emote. Lest you see? <laughs> No, we don't get, we don't argue, we don't get ugly about food in my Discord. I know, so a lot of people here, um, as a backstory, in case you don't know, I was a part of a podcast, um, and so a lot of, a decent amount of the people in here are people that I knew from there. Not everybody. I'd say, honestly, nowadays, it's pretty, it's pretty even split of people that I've met on Twitch and people that I've met there. Um, that podcast, uh, so that's where people get into ugly food talks. Who got pretty brutal on them? Oh yeah, that's true. I forgot about. Well, no, that wasn't that about chicken parmesan. I was. That was when I banned myself from the server. I didn't really ban myself from the server. Metaphorically, I did. All right. You've returned. That's that badge. I see. So you met the lad. But there's not a thing I can do against the Fiend Lord. To fight him would require the legendary Masamune, which is... No, it matters little. Even had I the blade, I have no right to wield it. Please, leave me be. Oh, give me this item now. A broken sword helmet. Oh, so he was supposed to be blocking it the whole time. Oh, okay, okay, okay. This is part of the Masamune. It's engraved with archaic letters. I think I can make it out. Um, let's see. M E L C H I O R. I'm gonna spit. I'm gonna say this way wrong. Is it Melchior? 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 That guy from Medina Village? What does this mean, Chrono? What does this mean, Chrono? There are none alive who could mend Masamune. Okay. Let's go find that guy. That's the guy from the very beginning of the game, right? Let's go find that guy. Ah, these snakes every time. Every time these snakes get us. Is 
the, did the music just get really quiet? Or did I accidentally touch my headset? I feel like maybe I accidentally touched my headset. Oh, God. I keep forgetting. Don't attack the frogs. Attack the snakes, and then the, the snakes will take care of the frogs. Mel choir? <laughs> was it? Was it? Did I say it wrong? Like, were the letters backwards? Hold on a second. frog eat that frog the audio didn't change for you okay yeah i must have bumped i have a volume knob right here on my headset and i uh bumped it i bump it a lot <laughs> it happens to be a lot okay so i think we're gonna we're gonna go and try get this um sword mended and stuff but I am going to have to wrap up here kind of soon. Like I said earlier, I'm not sure if many of you were here yet, but I do have to make today an, un an unfortunately short stream. Um, on top of having started early, uh, I have to go somewhere later. Uh, and I also apologized if you weren't here that I missed yesterday's stream. I had a last minute family thing come up, but it was nothing bad. Everybody's okay. Nothing, nothing crazy happened. Um, it was just something I didn't have penned in for the day that I then took care of, so... Uh, but we're good. Okay. I don't know which village it said I needed to go to. I'm assuming it was this guy. Nope, not that- oh wait, that guy has new stuff. Oh no, that's not new stuff. What am I thinking? Oh, okay, you had the stream window <laughs> minimized. Okay, I'm not crazy then. Oh wait, was that a different time? Melchior Village? That would make sense because obviously, yeah, there's nobody around now who can make it, but there was that guy. Ah, oh, okay, I know, I know. There's that guy in the past. Sorry, I'm banging on my desk a little bit, so I don't know if it's that's picking up in the mic. Um, there's a guy in the past who is making the, he's making the bell. Do you think it's that guy? Let's see if we can get there. Because I don't think it's this guy, is it? Just as I was preparing to put the finishing touches on Lean's bell, our king was wounded by Magus's fiends in battle. Oh wait, we are in that time period. It's enough to make a man lose his will to work. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I did run back and we were just talking to Frog. But right now it looks like we need to get the we need to get the sword mended. Um, in order to get Frog. Uh, and we need to go to some guy in a village that I can't remember which village it is. So, uh... I don't know. Maybe I do need to time travel to do it. But it wouldn't make sense that we would have to go into the future. And I don't know if there was any time in the past that we could go to. Let's see if we can... If we can. I understand now. Why some of these fights are optional. What's that emo? Mind your manners. Ooh, I like that. I like that. Alright. Oh yeah, I do want to hear his tune again. Tune again. Tune again. Ah. Uh, tuna. <laughs> Oh, making a pretty emote art. Okay, I wish it would tell me. I'm sure there's some sort of map that I'm not figuring out. Go to Medina Village, 1080. So I think it is. Truce Canyon. Medina Village sounds like the place that I need to go. But I would think that I need to go to the past. 65,000 or 65 million BC. That's the future, right? Or is that after? No, that's 80. Okay, let's go to the. Let's go to the super past. Can we go here? Oh, I, th I feel like I'm going to the wrong place. 
What is this music? I don't remember being here. I haven't been here. Uh-oh, did I make a mistake? Boost attack and defense. Cannot control wearer. Oh, you cannot be controlled. Let's do that. Oh yeah, this has a great soundtrack. That is a fact. Oh, cannot control wearer. Like, I can't control the wearer. I thought it meant like they couldn't be confused. Uh, I'm gonna have to take that ring off. <laughs> you watched the YouTube video of all of Final Fantasy Ultra's appearances in the franchise? I didn't know that he had cameos in other games. But then again, I hadn't played it when I played any of the other games. So now I'll have to go back and play other games and see. See if I can spot him. Um, I have to tell you guys, I've been thinking real hard about I might start playing Final Fantasy XIV. Um, I just can't decide if I want to dedicate the time. So, we'll see. We'll see what comes of that. Okay, let's take this equipment off of him. Sorry. Power glove back in it. Power glove back in. Your choice of voice acting in later games is super poor. I mean, that's just Final Fantasy in general. You know? You know what I mean? Can I just... What is happening down here? I'm gonna just skip a couple of these things. Mostly because I'm in a hurry. Yeah, we have not been to this time. An Ioka hut. I feel like I went way too far in the past. I feel like there's no way in hell these dudes are making Masamune, right? Okay, let's save. We're gonna probably- I'm gonna probably have to call it here for the night. Just because I'm a little lost. And if I get too into it, then we're gonna take too long. And like I said, I do have to be somewhere, um, and, and, which means I also have to get something done before I got to be somewhere. So I'm really sorry that it was a very short stream today. Um, you know, I tr normally try to go longer than this. Um, so, um, and then also I normally try to start on time and not miss streams. But I promise you guys, if you're newer here, I'm sorry. September has been really crazy for me. Um, I'm normally much more prompt and much more consistent. <laughs> yes, that's what she said. Garbage. That's what she said. Orthos and Ultras are the same character. Oh. Huh. Excellent. Alright. Well, let's see who's on that we can hit with a raid real quick. It's not my normal time, so I don't know who's normally on right now. Uh, let's see. Chaos Hand is on, and he is playing... He's playing Kirby's Dream Land 3. That looks fun. So let's stick with the retro... Let's go say hi to Chaos. This is great Steve Jobs too. Is that a real person? Oh, if I could fucking type. Chaos Hand 56. He's a oh, variety streamer as well. Uh, he's always playing something interesting. He's a nice dude. So I recommend checking him out. Hang around. Stay a while and listen. Hi, Boat Night. Bye, Boat Night. You caught the early stream, and, or the, 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 the short stream, and I'm ending early. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. But anyways, uh, if you guys aren't already in the Discord, and you want to hang out, you want to find out about stream updates, you should hit up the Discord. Other than that, thank you guys for hanging out. Uh, and again, I'm sorry that it is shorter and not at the normal time. But I didn't want to leave you hanging two nights in a row. Um, so also... <laughs> God damn, I'm the fucking worst. Tuesday night stream, probably not gonna happen. If I can, it's gonna be hella late. Um, so we'll see. We'll see what I can do about that. Um, and then Wednesday is not happening either. I'm going to a hockey game for free. Vegas Golden Knights, baby. Woo, 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 woo. Um, but Thursday, we'll be back for sure by then, right? Okay. All right. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. October's gonna be back to normal, baby. Back to normal, baby. All right. Anyway. I'll, s I'll catch you guys next time, and uh, I will update you guys in the Discord on what on what's going on with the schedule. So, smell you later. Say hi to Chaos for me.